Uh, your song, Ice Ice Baby, number one. That was the week of our birthday, by the way. Halloween. Yep, Halloween. I had these devil worshippers one time come up to me, man. It was kind of weird in Japan. You know, she came to me at one of my shows in this trench coat, and she, like, opened up her trench coat, and she was butt naked in there. I'm sitting there performing, and she was flashing me. Every time I would look her way, flash, flash, flash. And uh, she looked pretty good, you know? <laughs> and so she got my attention. I mean, I was like, wow, okay. Nothing wrong with that. She followed the show around and, and uh, slide some satanic hard copy Bibles under my door and shit. Next night, I changed rooms with my manager because just in case this happens again. Well, guess what? Three o'clock, knock, knock, knock. It was pretty ugly. I was pretty scared and they had like messages written to me and because my birthday's on Halloween. We had, we had security guards at the actual elevator. They had blocked off the whole uh, floor. We were on like the 50 something floor. We didn't have any idea it was a girl at the time. Oh. They tackled her in the hallway. The uh, security guards, so we went out and saw what the hell was going on and who this was that was putting these satanic Bibles and stuff around, and all of a sudden it was, it was this chick and she was hot. And the same girl that was flashing me, they caught her in the hallway because she crawled up the fire escape to get on the floor. She knocked out the little lights down the hallway with a stick, glass everywhere. You know, you could see that look in her eyes. Yeah, there was something scary about her, you know. She was very confused. She goes down to her knees and starts crying. <laughs> I'm so sorry, I can't help it. Somebody please help me. All the guys hear the commotion, so they all come out of the room. Everybody's out of the room. We're all in the hallway surrounding this girl. She was going in and out of uh, being possessed. And she goes, you can't have him. She did just about everything but spin her head around. And everybody like moved back like 10 feet. And the hair on my back stood up. I'm like, ah! My jaw is hanging on the ground. And sure enough, she was like, freaking out and she would snap back out of it and she would be like, I'm so sorry, I didn't mean to do that. I can't help it, I can't control myself. They found out she was from some satanic church in Ireland. Her parents put her up to it. She had been in the satanic church from generation after generation and uh, they wanted me to convert and basically preach to my fans Satanism. <laughs>